hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is Banda Kiki the unapologetic african lesbian and entrepreneur first of all valentine's day doesn't have to be boring or lonely if you are in a long distance relationship so if you're listening to this and you're in long distance relationship today i am going to be sharing five unique ways of celebrating valentine's day if you are in a long distance relationship but before we get into it there's this thing that my friend always says that lesbians are always in a long distance relationship and i think it's some sort of a stereotype so if you're watching this video do you think there's an element of truth in it please do leave a comment via the comment section so that i can know what you think but anyways um my first tip on how to celebrate valentine's day if you're in long distance relationship is to write a handwritten letter see there is a difference between reading your girlfriend your boyfriend or your wife's text uh, via whatsapp instagram or whatever platform you guys communicate on and then there's it's another thing to actually hold the words in your hand sleeve the paper see the handwriting and just take it all in and if you're wondering yes <laughs> i think a lot of you have already guessed anyways uh, i'm a massive fan of handwritten letters and i feel like it's some sort of a it's a dying practice it's it's an old charm that people some people still have some people don't have it's very rare these days so yeah um writing them a handwritten, handwritten letter can really go a long way uh, to make them feel closer to you even from a distance so um my second tip on how to celebrate valentine's day if you're in a long distance relationship is to do a surprise food delivery and zoom dinner so now um you know like uh, there's you can google go online check the restaurants around your girlfriend or boyfriend or wife or husband and uh, order them a meal you know a surprise meal and what can even be nice is to order yourself that same meal around your own area yeah and then you have uh, this dinner together over zoom teams uh whatsapp or again whatever platform you guys use to do your video calls it can be so cute and it would make you guys feel a lot closer together even from a distance yeah because of course a lot of people are going to be going out and having their valentine's day dinner uh, dates who says you can't have them from a distance who said that? who said that so uh, my third tip on how to celebrate valentine's day if you are in a long distance relationship is to send them a gift basket with all the cute little things that your partner likes you know um for example there could be a candy that they like there could be something that maybe if you guys are in different countries and there's been something that i've been telling her about it or telling him about it and they've never tried it before this is an opportunity to send them that stuff to try it could be candy it could be maybe a drink you know if you can't post something like that it could be anything to be honest all the cute little things that they like all in one basket it can it can it can even be a shoe box not even a basket but a shoe box okay and who says you can't even add that handwritten letter in that shoe, shoe box itself so yeah send them a cute nice parcel of all it, it doesn't see to be honest you don't have to buy somebody something really expensive to touch their heart it, it's, it's just if you put some thought in it if you if you uh, remember things that maybe they thought you were not listening but you were listening it can go a long way to make them feel special okay and feel and make them feel very close to you even though you guys are in a long distance relationship so my fourth tip on how to celebrate valentine's day even if you're in a long distance relationship is to watch a romantic uh movie together um of course when you're in a long distance relationship you don't get to cuddle up on the sofa and put some nice romantic movie on and enjoy as a couple so yeah you can, can do that on valentine's day to be honest there are so many uh platforms that would allow you to do that i think even facebook at the moment they allow uh people to watch uh, something together i don't know if it has to be on the platform or you can bring it from other, another platform i don't know to be honest but yeah um if you're watching this and you know of such platforms where couples can um watch movies together please do uh, mention the platforms below so that you know you're helping us okay <laughs> you're helping a lot of us so yeah so um please do um share um via the comment section as well and if you're also watching this uh video and you know uh, a lot of lesbian movies that couples can watch together please do list them below <laughs> i need those movies to be honest i need them for myself 
okay <laughs> list them below um list the platforms as well because it's not enough saying loving annabelle i know loving annabelle is a good one or enough saying uh blue is the favorite color i think it's not enough to say that please when you list a, when you list the movie list a platform that um uh, we can watch that movie on okay 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 thank you my last tip on how to celebrate valentine's day if you are in a long distance relationship is to take your partner on a tour of your neighborhood now sometimes when you are in a long distance relationship and you have never been where your partner is sometimes you often wonder um where the corner shop that they've always been talking about is where this neighbor is what the house looks like you know you tend to wonder things like that and sometimes it makes you feel uh, uh, a bit distant from them when you can't imagine them in that space I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. Even the house, you can't imagine how what the house looks like if you've never seen the house as well. Sometimes it can make you feel like, mm, I'm not very close to them, you, you understand? So go outside, it's not enough to show them the room and inside the house, go outside, show them what the, look, the house looks like from the outside. Show them the garden if you have to. Um, show them the neighbors, the, that neighbor they've been bitching about. <laughs> Uh, on, on, on the call with her you can show them their house please do it legally don't say kiki said no do it legally please <laughs> or don't do it in a way that it's you know you're stalking them off whatever uh, show them around the neighborhood take them to the corner shop where you buy all those your things your drinks uh, or where you do your grocery shopping do that it would make them feel closer to you make them feel like they know you if that makes sense again especially if your partner has not been around that place especially if they've not been around that place would really mean a lot to them and it would make it would make them feel like they're part a very uh, big part of your life okay but anyways if you have enjoyed this video please please don't watch my videos and run away please help me this video rank high on youtube um algorithm or whatever it is like this video gives it a thumbs up comment tell your friends to tell their friends about this channel it's our channel for example now you're going to be leaving that list of uh and um, lesbian movies to watch we enjoy it it's like a whole conversation happening here i talk you talk as well only i do it on camera and you do it via the comment section so give this video give this video a thumbs up share comment like and every other thing and as always it's been nice talking to you guys and until next time bye